You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. You had your gun trained on those deviants at the Eden Club. Why didn't you shoot? I don't know. I don't know. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened? Whatever. The FBI have been taking over the investigation. You should be off the case. Well, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Think that's RA-9? Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. If you give yourself up, Maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Oh. running a fever we've spent the last few nights outside she's exhausted what will I do without her let's let them be do you know what happened if the police find them here We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! Get yourselves ready. We leave tonight. Our broadcast is all over the news. We got what we wanted. Now humans know. It was a mistake to reach out to them. They'll never negotiate with their slaves. We should have shown them that we're prepared to fight. Violence is never the answer. Dialogue is the only way. I'm sure the humans will listen to us. They'll be watching us now. Whatever we do next, we need to think about public opinion. Since our broadcast, more and more have been coming to Jericho. At least our message gave our people hope. Killing humans wasn't part of the plan. They kill our people every day. Do you think they agonize about it? That's no reason for us to become murderers. If killing is the price of freedom, I'll pay it gladly. Killing never freed anyone. It just leads to more hatred. You're too fond of humans, Josh. Maybe their lives matter to you more than ours. If you think murdering humans is gonna make us free, then you're as bad as they are. That's enough. And now what are we going to do? There are five cyber life stores across Detroit. All selling us like merchandise. We're going to attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. Not to mention police. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems, and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. This is a night our people will remember. I've been waiting a long time for this.
It's okay, they're gone. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. The store's over here. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. We are superior to them, but they are our masters? That's about to change. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's ten minutes until all our teams attack. What are we waiting for? alarm system found it where do we start I identify the security system I think we'll be able to deactivate it just follow me There's traffic on the road. We need to block it. It's one way. It shouldn't be too difficult. You're free now. should bother us now. You'll soon be with us.
you're awake now, go to Jericho. Marcus, watch out! You were committing a class 3 offense. This infraction is being reported to the police. Stay where you are. I told you to watch out! You said watch out, but not what for? Oh, I'm sorry. Next time you need to take cover, I'll send you a memo. What's wrong with you? You crazy or what? The cops were coming. I had to do something. Never do that again. Got it? North. We've got to hurry. We don't have much time. Looks like the plaza's secure. Now we can get inside the store. And how do you plan on doing that? We need to find a truck to ram the storefront. A truck? There's construction work in the area. Shouldn't be too hard to find one. There it is. What are we waiting for? Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. I knew we'd end up doing something fun. You don't have to obey them. You're free.
you, okay? Let's get them out of here. My name is Marcus, and just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom, and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm, I'm with you, you Marcus. Marcus! We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! We're with you. I'm with you! I'm with you! I'm with you! Then follow me! Marcus, what are you doing? I'm going to send the humans a message. They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow. Marcus. This message.
All teams have completed their missions, Marcus. They're coming. Everyone fall back to Jericho. We sent a message without violence, just like you wanted. You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. I hope you know what you're doing. You can't fight violence with violence. Unless there's no other choice. killed our people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. They have to pay. You don't have to do this. No. Please. Please. won't punish a crime with another crime. We interrupt this broadcast with breaking news. This just in. At exactly 2 a.m., several Cyber Life stores in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding rights for androids and other obscure slogans. Police report that pro-android graffiti was found in the neighborhoods of Cyber Life stores, and they're still investigating. Two policemen were found in a state of shock near one of the Cyber Life stores. Now, according to our sources, they confirmed that the attackers were a group of androids. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? <laughs> 